I can always remember as a kid, we were going, we'd go up and we'd cut wood. Like, we were small. You'd be out in the bush with mom and dad and my aunts and uncles and that, and you'd be cutting wood. And then uh, you'd always go to grandma's for like a big meal after, and you'd just be like completely done because you're out there and it was nice and cold. And then all of a sudden you go in and she had an old cook stove and it'd just be about 100 degrees in there and you just feel like <laughs> you wouldn't even want to move afterwards. <laughs> always around Labor Day, Thanksgiving time, it'd always be everyone grab their trucks and go up and bring wood home and so that's why we, I wanted the outdoor furnace was because we load it in the dump trailer, we bring it home that day, we pile it, next time it picked up it goes right in the furnace, it takes out all that handling versus having to repile it over and over and over again. I get my wood from a place called Lamb Moor, which is about half an hour north of here, which is a family farm that's been around for generations and generations. And we cut and split our own wood. And it's nice because I don't have to only cut hardwood out of my bush, I can cut soft woods too. So not only are you not just wasting it, you're actually using it to heat your home. I was always interested in the outdoor wood furnaces with the fact of your woods outside, less handling, less dirt for the house. Being that we're in the rural community here, I can't have a just regular outdoor furnace blowing smoke all over my neighbor's houses. When I found out about this, then that was, to me, the only real way to go. My wife uses it. She, uh, I grew up around wood heat all my life. She never did, but this is easy. I cut and split my wood small enough that she's able to handle it. And uh, she has no problems coming out and filling the furnace. And so I can be away for a day or two and she comes out and she, she can keep it going because it's easy and user friendly to, to use because you pull the bypass door, all the smoke goes out, you crack your door open slowly and it's good to load. And it doesn't matter if hydro, flux is up or down, my heating's next to nothing. Other than the few pumps that it runs, you're not depending on anybody else but yourself. And you can keep your house as warm as you want. <laughs> that's, as long as the wood's there, you have lots of heat.